All right, let's let's just continue here. Hey, shut up! We're looting here. Hey, let's Not talk. The loot. Interested in the sorcerers who lived here. And we're supposed to believe that. Yeah. Most likely hiding in some rat trap with the rest of them. Someone's got to know more. I'd look for her in a putrid grove. Putrid grove. Where is it? I wouldn't know. Rumor has it, it's a place for freaks and oddities. You'd fit in well there. Maybe. Mm. Thing is, got to know how to get there. They say you've got to get there through the sewers, but you've got to enter them outside of town. Few know where exactly, though. Ask a beggar. Or spot yourself a thief and follow him. Beggars and thieves got to pay tribute to the king of beggars. Word is, they do it in a grove. Mean to say the local beggars have a king? Crown, scepter, and all that? Wouldn't scoff, mate. King of beggars, it's a moniker. Yeah, for a man who everyone in Novigrad respects deeply. And watch yourself. Menger himself don't even go to the grove. Someone call for me. Wonder why. Oh, it's this guy. It's Menga. Temple God. Thieving vermin to the confession chamber. What, well, but sir, what's the offense? This is some sorceress bitchy shop. Think that gives you the right to steal her property? Well, sorcerers, mages of all types are outlaws. But by law. The temple guard takes possession of their belongings, and the rule of law still holds in Novigrad. They look. You know a bat can what? sniff out a moth a mile away. <laughs> I was about to say they look like a bunch of candy canes. What's your point? I ask the questions, Witcher, and as bats sense moths, so I sense freaks. And start by warning them. Novigrad's no place for your kind. Novigrad doesn't seem like it's a kind for anyone. I haven't done anything wrong. But you will. Sooner or later, your sort always causes trouble. And this city's mine to protect. Mine. And the eternal fires. Nothing I can do to you now. But just know that I know you're here. One misstep. One error, you'll make a mistake, it's inevitable. I'll be the first to learn of it. And okay. when I do, it'll be standard procedure. Like for every magic oddity who dares taint this city's air. Be seeing you. Be seeing you. Okay. Look for thieves on the main square and carefully follow them. Just make sure that we go through all these. Aha, nice. Get that loot. Received. Who that? Oh, deepest apologies, Governor. Fetch some metal, you wretch. I've been robbed. Thief. I love how he noticed. Mm. Oh, wait, John. Of wait, it says wait for look for thieves on the look for thieves on the main square. Talk with beggars about the king of beggars. That's definitely a thief right there. 
Oh, there he goes. Bloody easy. More hey, what you doing there? Thought. Can't get too close. Oh, okay. Stop, thief. So we just need to follow him. I get caught. I think I got Why caught. What the hell are you following me? Shit. Just happened to be going where you're going. And how the bloody hell do you know where I'm going? I don't. Never said I knew where you were going. Just think we're going in the same direction. Then you best change yours. Aha. Uh, the bonny birds that prance by here teats like poor bellows begging to squeeze. Ah, give you I think I kind of remember this. Just a little bit. The next chance we get, we're going to have to hit up the, uh, the armor. See if there's any upgraded gear that he has at all. Or any that I can make. More cautious than I thought. Can't get too close. Okay, now this is a dead end. Nosy bugger. Hmm? Yeah, terrible trait. Poking around where I probably shouldn't be, I know. But I gotta find the putrid grove. That's a secret place for secret folk doing secret business. And who's to say you're any good at keeping a secret? Me? Got my Me. word. You have my word. A freak's bilgy gas, not more. How stupid do you think I am? Okay. Grab the horse, son. Smash the bugger. Son of a whore. That's it, you're in for it. Got him. <laughs> what? All right. There you go. He needed one more hit, and it took me that long. Cause he had his guard up. Stop. Enough. I was just following orders. Got a simple question. You're what gonna the... give me a simple answer. <laughs> what just happened? Where's the putrid grove? In... In Lysol's. Down an alley. Man, guarding the gate. Gotta give him the password. What is the password? Old sows. Farrowed piglets. See? Just gotta make the effort. Thank you. That's not your stomping ground. Okay, I'm using my uh, stuff to heal up just a little bit. Uh, 
shady well, individual. <laughs> who's to say you're not the freak? Whoa, who's this? <laughs> it's a party here. Uh, wait, hold on. If this guy is open, let's see. Oh no, he has a quest. What do you have on offer? Redanian dumplings, speciality of the house, heartily recommended. Blimey, a vat gun in my establishment? It can't be. How do you know I'm a witcher? You joking? Silver blades, who else uses them? Crafted in Mahakam, am I right? Must be about 40 inches long? 40 and a half. Still impressed. You're something of an expert, evidently. I'm Ibir Hattori, former master swordsmith. Currently, a master of dumplings. Ah, of Rivia. he's a former. How might I help you? Care to try a dumpling? Looking for a good swordsmith. Looking for a good swordsmith. No one. <laughs> Three swords on your back. A bit much, don't you think? Good one. But all jests aside, you make swords anymore? Really? It's dumplings now. I must make a living. But I miss the hammer, anvil, and bellows. Oh, the heat of the forge. Were it not for that swiving Van Horn. Don't know what you're talking about. Uh, I shan't greet a witcher with dumplings. Come, let me show you something. <laughs> that dog's barking at something. Quite a collection. Premium quality, too. Thank you. I've kept these as mementos. Damn shame you don't make them anymore. I'd gladly replace what I have with this kind of steel. Someone with your skills? Why the hell are you needing dough? This might surprise you. The pay is better. But above all, it's much safer. Food vendors rarely disappear or end up as cripples. I see. Someone controlling Novigrad smithing market? Not officially, though... All supplies go through Ernst Van Horn. And they say he plays cards with Cleaver, frequently. Tried negotiating? Making a deal? With Van Horn? Do you just- I can make a deal for you. Proper heartless bastard. Either play by his rules and pay him, or go out of business. Hmm, I see. But I shan't complain. Dumplings have proven an excellent source of income. It's just... Well... You miss the heat of the forge. Tried getting supplies from someone else? Those rogues of the underworld control all the sources. How am I to talk to them? Unless... Would you be willing to help me? Want me to help you get you some- Just come take it. Yeah, it's- Alright. We get it. Oh, I don't know. I bad oh man, this would have been- Okay. We got it. I don't know if we'll do it, but knock knock. Open up. Who are you and what you want? Take a look. What do you see? Yellow eyes. Pair of swords. Mutated kill at me, feet. Heard this place was a meeting spot for oddities. Heard right. Know the password, get him free. Don't know it. Got to contribute to the Graves upkeep. Old sows, farrowed piglets. Old sows, farrowed piglets. Ah. Welcome to the Grove, brother. Easy enough. Oh, 
Aha, there she is. Time we made something clear, sorceress. Yes, high time. Me and my men will manage just fine without the help of you or any other mages. But you, well, without our help, you're sitting ducks for the temple guard. Who do I spy? Geralt? Atris. See you two know each other. See you two know each other well. I was curious whether you'd managed to find me, Witcher. Your spies tell you I was looking for the Putrid Grove? My skull would be a home for bottom-feeding riverfish if I didn't keep an ear to the ground. And please, Putrid Grove? Ugly name for our cozy little hideout, wouldn't you say? Temple Guard tolerate your little operation? Let's say they appreciate the value of a Novigrad crown. Hmm. Manga doesn't seem like the type that can be bought. Anyone can be bought, but like is true, Menger had cost me a fortune. Luckily, he's got officers, and they're mere mortals. Illnesses catch him at times. Other times, they want to catch a bit of diversion. See, Witcher? I've got plans. Big plans. Far-reaching plans to reshape this city head to toe. Ever thought of seeking a seat on the city council? City Council is a puppet troop with the hierarchy of the Church of the Eternal Fire as its puppeteer. Until recently, that is, when Radovid and his witch hunters took the reins. The semblance of power don't interest me. Hey, what do you want? A man with a vision. One day, the so-called free city of Novigrad will be truly free. But before that can happen, we got a riddit of superstition, farting around about the hallowed essence of the eternal fire. Nonsense for kiddies. Apparently not. Cheering crowd at the execution. Mostly adults. Any crowd a rabble will cheer to the stench of burning flesh. But one day, folk will understand the eternal fire's naught but a leash around their necks. They call this place the Putrid Grove. But it's the rest of Novigrad that's putrefied. This year's the last bastion of normality, sanity, reason. I'm actually glad someone like you's found his way to our city. Because it will be our city one day, Geralt. Mark my words. Yours, plural. Yeah, mine. And me friends. But that's a tale for another time. For now, I'll leave you two alone. Because I can see, well, you clearly need it. Gerald, I have a lot of things to take care of in town. I'll be glad to tag along. All right. Time to have a chat. What's your arrangement? He using you? Helping me to survive, actually. Six months ago, if somebody said Triss Marigold would be working for a Novigrad criminal, I'd never have believed it. Six months ago, Triss... Madam Sorceress. Beautiful as ever. Damn shame to part. Don't fret. Bound to be back soon. I take it you're a Novigrad on important business. Important doesn't do it justice. I'm looking for someone. More precisely? Young woman, who's like a daughter to me. Her? Here? No, impossible. She was here. There are witnesses, evidence. Was hoping you'd heard something. You've been here a while. I need you to help me find something, anything, a trace. I'll do everything I can. Who might know more? <laughs> Let's just walk, walk straight through that crowd of people. <laughs> okay, so who are we going to meet now? A guy that makes potions? 
looks like maybe. Hello, Klug. Managed to get those magic incense ingredients? Yes, somewhat with uh, difficulties, you might say. I was walking along the canal with a sack full of goodies for you. Looked up and spied a trio of temple guards coming the other way. Get to the point, Klug. No time today for one of your long stories. Wait! A sack full of magicalities and they were coming straight towards me. I don't easily frighten, but uh, I felt a cold sweat on my arse, I did. I'm afraid I had no choice. I dropped the sack in the water. I had to. When asked why, I claimed it contained a dead cat. You shan't believe this, but they believe me. I need that package, Klug. I've got a contract. It must be on the canal bed. Luckily, it was heavy enough to sink. I'm sure it'll turn up if you search. You expect me to pay you, then die for my goods into that ice-cold filth? Ugh, I got it. I can do that. Where'd you toss the package? Near the crane. Second bridge in from the harbor. I didn't expect such devotion. Wanted to freshen up anyway. Let's go. Stop. Hear that? They've come for us. The fool didn't break until I began to prick his heels. Every man's got his sensitive spots. Interrogated a mage once. Pain couldn't touch him. Tore off his fingernails, crushed his bollocks. Nothing. Turned out uh -oh. he was devilishly ticklish. He about to bust in. the beetle on his belly and set a mug atop it. Damn near went mad. We were lucky this time, but you'd best leave via the sewers. The trap door's in the floor. Take care of yourself, Klug. A good day for commerce. It's a lot here. I love how nobody ever minds. And we we won't go up. We'll just go down. Oh, great. Nothing like some good old monster hunting in the sewers. Ugly bastard. How did you get down here? Lot here, jeez. Must be a lever on this wall that'll open the secret passage. Oh, you mean like this thing? Maybe not. Uh. A lever on the wall. I'm not seeing anything. Uh, wait, here it is. Free city of Novigrad. They actually used to mean something. The very reason so many mages came here after the massacre at Loch Nguyen, thought they'd be safe from Radovid's reapers. Instead, they jumped out of the frying pan into the into the fire. She can never Judging finish any of her sentences. The parcel should be around here <laughs> on the bottom. It's okay. Neither can I. The poor man was mistaken. He's been forgetful ever since Manga interrogated him. Seems to be suffering from a persecution complex, too. Current must have carried the sack seaward. I'll swim towards the port. Coming with? Uh, maybe some other time. Don't know what you're missing. Water's thick with pungent oils. Guessing it'll do wonders for my complexion. <laughs> Find the lost parcel. I'm thinking about turning off the, uh... One sec. Um... The fisheye portion of this. apparently you can turn it off and just do like a regular um 
regular search. Let me see actually. Options. Gameplay. <coughs> Movement response alternative. Hmm. Turn off which your fish eye effect, yeah. Any old sort of drawing slash sheathing. Automatic finishers, on screen tutorials, enemy upscaling. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I think that's a little bit better. Find the parcel? It just zooms in and it doesn't do like the fish Not eye effect anymore. Swim in the filthy canal. Found a few fish, a rusty anchor, the carcass of a boat. Oh, and this. Oh, my package. Hope the contents aren't soaked through. Oh, you're a doll. Seem to be in your element. Still remember my elements? How I use them? Come on, six months isn't that long. It's not like I'm senile. But you do have a history of amnesia. I've recovered my memory completely. Good. Mm -hmm. That should stop people from taking advantage of you. Someone's been taking advantage of me. I have, for one. I've never even intimated. I think I remember this guy. Greetings, Brandon. I think I remember I this part. Expect you to bring company. Tris, you told this man you're a sorceress? Of course. She was looking for work. That's her chief asset. Are you, Triss? I know it was reckless, but competition's stiff here. No one would hire me if I claimed to be a common rat catcher. More importantly, no one would believe such a beauty could be an exterminator of rodents. <laughs> but I'd prefer you not to tarry and begin. Triss, you and Brandon here. You've agreed a price. We settled on a full coin purse. Brandon & Co. is a serious outfit. We've the largest granary in all Novigrad. All right then. Let's get to work. We need to place these crystals around the granary. Near anything that looks rat related. I remember doing this, actually. I don't know how. I'll cover half the space. You take the other half. Look for evidence of rat activity. Mm-hmm. Thing is, I know what evidence of manticore activity looks like, but rodents? Geralt, we'd both rather be somewhere else. I'd rather be sitting in a royal council meeting, but they killed my king. Look for crevices and droppings. Once we place this incense, what then? I'll cast a spell and the rats will leave. Can't do that without sprinkling incense? Don't really feel up to looking for rat shit. Stop whining. I've already completed it. <laughs> All right. I think I plugged every hole in there. All right. Get ready for some magic fireworks. Once I activate the incense, we'll have a moment to talk. Well, now we wait for them to scurry away. Interesting method. Never had much luck with rats. Once I hit one with a fork in complete darkness. Trying to show off my witcher's senses. His hair definitely Master grows throw, back really. even when you Probably select a different hairstyle. How could they in the dark? I thought it said that he wouldn't <laughs> grow back. So what do you think? Rat catcher? It's a long way to fall from being advisor to Temeria's king. I'm just glad to see you safe and sound. And reconciled. Are you truly? Knew a man once who reacted to everything, especially adversity, by mocking it. Healthy attitude. Must have lived long. Came a day he lost both his legs in battle. He shrugged, said it was better that way. He'd never feel pain in them again. I understand him perfectly. I know. Thing is, he was lying to himself. I think he just didn't have much of a choice. You could be right, but only he knows the truth. We're only ever the ones to know the truth about ourselves. Which we share at times with those we hold dear. Even if it's hard to swallow? Even then. Who knows? Maybe one day. 
So, tell me how Yen's doing? How do you know I found her? You didn't answer my question. How's Yen? She's fine. That's good. Asking about anything specific? Never mind. I got my answer. <laughs> and there they go. Well, well. Our love There's some having them big rats chat instead of working. The job's done. Geralt, those are... I know who they are, Triss. My friends begged me to notify them if I encountered a mage, sorceress, what have you. Didn't have the heart to refuse. It's a trap, Geralt. This stank from the start. Such a sharp sense of smell. You should have legged it while you had the chance. I don't generally leg it. Hmm. Here's what I think you should do. Pay up and march your boys out of here while there's still time. <laughs> don't be ridiculous. I didn't hire a sorceress in order to pay her. Check my advice, mutant. If it's not your business, stay out of it. Thanks for the advice, but I can't take it. All right, we've talked. Do what you gotta. Just remember, I can't help but get in your way. Heard enough from this horse, son. As have I. Neither is to leave here alive. I never understand. If not for you, we need to find Bran. Whoops. Oh no, it's gonna exit it. I knew it. Okay, now we're good. He's gonna be like <gasps> Don't kill what? me. Good sir, no. They forced me. Had I not told them, they'd have set fire to my home, my warehouse. The mage hunters know no mercy. Spare me, good man. Be not like those murderers. Shut up. I should kill you. Thing is, you'd be no good to anyone but the gulls as a corpse. So you'll live and pay us double. Now. <laughs> Fine. Pay for your life. Now get. Thanks, Geralt. No need. Glad I could help. You know, I've been thinking. The tree is getting in the way there. <laughs> and I just got an idea. There's an Oniromancer in town, Kareem Tilly. Very capable, supposedly. Never trusted in Dreamer's abilities myself. Kareem's been very effective. You should at least try. She's taken a job close by. Follow the canal away from the fish market. The house is near the first bridge. Its owner, Dijon Kier, is a rich banker. Not coming with me? I've got some things to take care of. Another rat infested <laughs> warehouse? <laughs> Not exactly. Tree. Nothing even remotely satisfying. Such are the times. It was nice to see you again. You too, Geralt. You should go now. Before Kareen goes back into hiding somewhere. What if I want to find you? I live in the bits, near the fish market. Stop by. It'll be nice. All right. See you later. All right. Find the dreamer in the old house. What was it happened to Aye. Just again? Double shows. Just passing by, wanderer? Or do you seek something specific? Who's asking? Rudolf de Jonkier. Of those de Jonkiers, yes. My ancestors laid the foundations of this city. I now own its largest bank. Didn't need a recommendation. Name would have been enough. 
Father always said, all ought to know your merit, son. Don't hide them under a bushel. I'm looking for Corrine Tilly. Well, you've come to the right place, then. Corrine is inside. Been there for a few days, dreaming the home's history. Let me in. I'd like to go inside, look around. I don't usually let strangers rummage around my home. Twin swords, though. You're a witcher. You may enter. Call that my whim. A second sword. Is it in case the first one breaks? Stop! Go away! Wake up. It's just a dream. Wake up. The doll. The attic. All right. Time to check the attic. I think I kind of remember this. Guys out there just letting her stay like this. Way to the next room is blocked. Destroying objects. It's right there. Pretty sure if I remember right, we have to come back up here <clears throat> and there will be something else. But I'm not sure. So I examine the drawing. I think it's this one. Second floor. Wonder what it ah, is. Ah, crap. Doll in it. <laughs> but we picked up two dolls. And where's the. Oh, wait. Oh, damn it. It's down there. Stop. Go away. It says below. Leave it. Oh, it's in the, the other room. There it is. Examine Another masterpiece. An oven and a blackened grate. Oh joy. A riddle. Guess I should find an oven. Examine the oven.
I hated that when I first played this. Hearing like the kid, kid laughing. Ah, so creepy. Assassin boots. Eh. Find some good stuff here. That wasn't even the right way. Uh, oh, there's the oven. Whoops. Yes. Scared you, didn't I? I can tell you were scared. Big brave man scared of wee little Sarah. Ain't that funny? I wouldn't do that anymore if I were you, Sarah. Godling, right? So bad they'll hurt you. Why would someone hurt me? Having a spot of fun's not allowed anymore. What are you playing? That lady fell asleep, and I've sent her some horrible dreams. I'll not her wake neither. I can do that, you know. Funny, isn't it? Very funny. Thing is, I gotta talk to the dreamer, so I'd like you to let her wake up. Little Sarah doesn't want her to wake. Little Sarah wants to play. I know what you are. You're lucky. I know you're a harmless godling, but others might not know, and then... And how'd you know I'm a godling, eh? How's that, eh? Eh? If it looks like one and acts like one, trust me. You're a godling. You give the dreamer nightmares and won't let her wake up. Why are you tormenting her? I'm not tormenting anyone. Scary dreams are great. What I love is when this big hen chases me. Hen's got these red. Why do you live in a haunted house? Tell you a secret. <laughs> the house ain't haunted. Not one bit. I just pretend it is. Make everyone think that. It was sitting there all empty. So I moved in. Bigwig from the bank then came and bought it. I don't like bankers, especially not to live with, so I decided to give him a scare. Gave the banker a really big scare. See, he paid a lot for this house and won't give it up easily, which is why you need to find another home. I don't want to! I don't! I won't! Let's make a deal. Sarah. A no deal you can't no refuse. Godling, but if you want to live here, that's your business. So let's make a deal. A deal? What kind? Leave the dreamer alone. In exchange, I'll tell the banker the house is haunted. For good, no way to lift the curse. You tell him that? What if he doesn't believe you? I'm a witcher. He'll believe me. Yes? 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 Do that and I promise not to bother your friend. Not even a little. You're awfully nice, you know. I don't hear that often. Thanks. Now go wake that sleepyhead. I won't stop her. She'll get up. <laughs> Godlings are so nice. And they listen to reason.